Today, the church is celebrating a Spanish saint who became a great missionary bishop, but I suspect most of you have never heard of him. He's got a really odd name, Toribio of Mogravejo. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki of the Apostleship of Prayer. Saint Toribio was born in the 1500s and in a decision that must have shocked him, was named the Archbishop of Lima, Peru. Why the shock? Well, not only did Toribio live thousands of miles across the ocean in Spain, but he was a layman. Seeing God's will in the Pope's decision, he accepted and was ordained and set sail for South America, where he became one of the greatest missionary bishops of all time. He established the first seminary in the Western Hemisphere, published catechisms in the native Indian languages, and at a time when native people were seen as inferior to Europeans, he encouraged native vocations. That didn't sit well with the Spanish conquistadors and even the local clergy. In fact, one of the reasons Toribio was chosen to go to Lima was because he was an honest and courageous man and the Archdiocese of Lima, a huge diocese extending some 400 miles along the Pacific coast and an ocean away from the king in Spain and the Pope in Rome, had become a mess and was filled with injustices and scandals. Toribio held fast, just the way Jesus did when he was confronted by his enemies. Today and for the rest of Lent, our Gospels at Mass will be from John's Gospel, we're going to see a growing controversy between Jesus and the religious leaders of his time. As we continue with Lent, let's pray that we may have the courage of the saints and of Jesus himself.